Hello YouTube, how y'all doing? Hope everybody's doing good. Y'all can see the title up there, right? Are you paying attention? It's all about your Second Amendment. And it really is. There's a lot of these people here that are wanting to get rid of crime. Okay? And I can understand that. We have a lot of crime in this country. We also have a lot of prisoners in this country. But if you think what you're trying to do here by getting rid of the Second Amendment uh, is going to change that, you're very wrong. Um, there's proven statistics when you have no guns you can't protect yourself so it's up to you people it really is it, it really is do y'all want to continue to live in a democracy or do you want to be in a republic like you're supposed to be and this picture right here, it says incorporated in 1871. That's right, sure does. You can see it again right here in the video, incorporated 1871. Now, I was going to have the robot read this article to you, but I just decided not to, because I want you to come over here and read it for yourself. I really do. Um, there is a lot of other stuff here as well. As you see, this is a video. And this is kind of about Sandy Hook. It is. And so was this one. And so was this one. Now, in the article above, they're talking about how they escalated when it become after Sandy Hook well I want you to watch this real all of these real closely and I have several more about Sandy Hook as well so y'all go look at those pay attention and then I got this down here pay attention again And then you ought to watch this lady about money. She gives you a lot of education about what's going on with the corporate entity of money. So y'all look and listen, pay attention to the videos and the articles course and I put up a couple of a new things yesterday and today well, I actually put up one new one that's this one the rest of these I just they've been down in the bottom of the pot for a long time and I just you know gave a, everybody attention to them again like this one this one and this one and this one well a lot of these actually were all recently pushed yesterday so they're getting some you know some activity and folks you know it's really odd to me that most of the videos that I make, they get viewed or don't get viewed. It doesn't matter. If I only get five people to pay attention to Incorporated 1871 and to abolish the Act 1871, not for the Second Amendment, they just incorporated because they had to. 
because of the Act 1871. And we're talking about the NRA. They incorporated so they could be part of the system so they could protect you on your rights for your Second Amendment. But yet, Obama and his oldest constitutional democracy and said that we needed to change our constitution multiple times because it's outdated. Him and Bush Jr. But it isn't. Our constitution ain't outdated. It's been corrupted and I'll go along with that all day long. But if you say it's outdated, it's been the best constitution in the world. You people in this country are more free than you any other country in the world. And we are and have become a democracy. And you're losing your freedoms faster than you've ever lost them in your whole life. In fact, depending how old you are, if you're my age, I've seen freedom start disappearing since I've been 30 years old at a rapid pace. And I'd say the last 20 years, it's speeded up even faster. Well, basically since 9-11 and so on with every new president since. <clears throat> it has gotten very fast with the president we have now. The one that has an illegal birth certificate that is a forgery. A forgery. And he says the oldest constitutional democracy in a speech and no one in the mainstream media calls him on it. And he says democracy in the State of the Union address. Did you know that he is the only president in history that's ever said that? Did you know that? And no one calls him on it? It's up to y'all folks. Do you want to be free? Do you want let me make it another way to you. Do you want your children's children to be free? Depending on how old you are, it could be just your children. Like if you got a two or three year old child or ten year old, depending on how rapidly they take this, which it looks as if they're going full speed ahead with all the threats of wars in several countries with Obama's executive order and it looks as if they did it so China would back Russia and we owe Russia money and it's all in financial or not financial but mortgages Hmm. Don't it kind of make sense to y'all that if we owe China money and, and on mortgages and that's the biggest thing that's our downfall in this country, don't you think that Russia, I mean China, is going to be kind of pissed off when we renege to pay them because China's back in Russia in the Ukraine incident? Doesn't that make a little bit of sense to y'all that you know, we're in deep shit. And it don't hurt nobody but us. We're the ones that's going to pay. It's up to y'all, folks. Freedom, liberty, and sovereign. Or corporate entity slaves. It's up to y'all. From my cold, dead hands, much love. Have a great day.